just it on. It's Friday night, and live on 2K Sports, we're going to bring you the NBA in all its excitement. This is Kevin Harlan with Greg Anthony and Clark Kellogg and our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. Coaching staff and team leadership that's able to work together and get you through some of the bumpy spots, which every team is going to have. Keep everybody pulling and working in the same direction. Don't get too high or too low and stay focused on the process of getting better consistently. It's stolen. Starks outside. Johnson for three. That one's in his first shot this game. Nicely done by John Starks there. Got the ball right to the shooter on time and on target. Passes it to Morning. Fires from the corner. And that one's good by Marlon. And if you're the guy who has to guard him, it is never going to be an easy night for you. Starks kicks to Ewing. Starks, right side. It's hauled in by the Heat. This their first look at this year's New York squad. And two teams here that were evenly matched a season ago as they split the season series. Yeah, they'd settle for 500 against most teams. Both squads win challenge, perhaps a way to put it. But one of them has got to win tonight. So it's New York now, following the three by Miami that went in. They grab their own miss. Here's Starks. Set it up with the fake, but it's offline. Here's Mashburn. Yes, and it's Hardaway picking up the assist. Mashburn's got five points so far. And whether it's from deep, inside, mid-range, Jamal Mashburn is at home as a score. Here's Ewing. New York, no good that time either. Boy, he knows he should have knocked that one down, especially with the defense not giving much of an effort. Boy, he is looking confident. Love how they're using him so far. And you know what? They're going to keep using him. I mean, he'll be the centerpiece of their offense today. You can bank on that. Now here's Johnson. His second shot Larry goes in. Johnson. Off to a good start, two for two. Once Larry Johnson has the rock in close, you might as well put up two on the scoreboard. Hardaway with it. Pass to Morning. Some nice ball movement here by the Heat. Chalk up two there. Marley's got his third basket of the night right there. The ball distribution was there. I mean, outstanding work all the way around. On the wing, Johnson. Here in the first, just under two and a half minutes played so far. Ewing can't hit. Yeah, and that was lining up to be a huge alley-oop, but they just couldn't quite connect. And you know, guys, always a tough catch on the lob. Placement and timing have to be close to perfect. And here are the Knicks now. Alonzo Mourning unable to get his shot to go. Starts the pass to Johnson. And they call the foul, so a chance at the line for one more coming up. Yeah, he earned that one. I mean, taking the hit and still able to get that one to go down. Incredible, incredible body control right there. Don't know how he was able to get that one to go. But it sure was a thing of beauty to watch. Ewing. Johnson finds Ewing. And the shot is good from Johnson. And a nice job here early of establishing an inside presence. Marley passes to Morning. Hardaway for three. It's rebounded by New York. Inside. And then Johnson with the dunk. Boy, Johnson showing you that impressive leaping ability. Terrific at rising up for the throwdown. Hardaway passes to Brock. They need this. A putback, and it's Brown on the follow. Great job of crashing the offensive glass. He stayed with it. That's hard-nosed, tough basketball. The pass to Houston. 
drives to the hoop, and it is flushed down with a nice jam. I like seeing Houston use that athleticism of his on the drive, scorching the defense in the process. Miami trails by three. On deep, Marley. Rebound by Johnson. Pass to Houston. Starks outside. Johnson outside. Six for six. He's yet to miss from the field. I mean, the number of points they've scored in the paint already here is eye-opening. Miami's gone. One of three from beyond the arc so far in the game. Passes it to Brock. By the way, from outside, here's Marley. Sinks it after the KG pump fake. Marley's got eight. And Hardaway always looking to incorporate his, his teammates. You can see him keeping his eyes moving in order to make sure he's ready to deliver to the open man. Now, here is Starks. Still scoreless. Ewing. Oh, he misses the dunk. Now, here's Marley. Tight defense on him. And that one drops for him. Excellent at playing through contact. Marley is a guy who plays with great physicality and energy himself. Here he's checked in for Brown. Charles Oakland, he's checked in for New York. At the line for one, Dan Marley. That free throw good for Marley. And the Knicks decide to take their first time out here. Start. The Knicks have gone 8 of 15 from the field, shooting above 50% here tonight. Or the pass to Houston. From 15 feet away, nice jump shot. Good. Houston's got his second bucket of the game to go. This is why I love his game. You really have to admire his tenacity. Pass to Barry. Morning with it. And the rebound paying off as they pick up two on the second chance bucket right there. Yeah, and Morning's just a beast on the glass, using that muscular frame to get into prime position there on the board. Now, here is Stark. Oh, oh that's an old-fashioned rim wrap. Uh, just a remarkable jam. These fans' jaws are on the ground right now. Platinum-level highlight reel material. That is showtime stuff there. Here's Hardaway, following the score by New York. And a fast break now for the Knicks. And the dunk to finish it off, a uh, beauty. Boy, check out Starks grappling for that loose ball, looking to finish the play himself. That's good work by the guard. Hardaway for three, drills the three-pointer. And he's not going to miss that sort of an opportunity from deep. Here's Ward. 11 points last game. And he drives in. And Charles Oakley out there with the slam. Yeah, he doesn't throw it down much, but I love seeing Oakley hammer it down like that. Good job, Oak. Hard away from outside. And again, Miami with the triple. I'll tell you what, I'm not sure these guys can keep this up. High octane action for sure. Crowd pleasing already. Here's Ward. He's a good contributor to his team, averaging about 10 and a half points a game. And the Heat making a change here. Austin's checked in. And New York with a change here, too. Mills is checked in. Starts the pass to Ewing. Over Morning. A nice shot by Ewing. And the Knicks lead by two. Very self-confident in the paint. Ewing excels at scoring close to the hoop. And Morning throws it down. Man, what a pass that was there. He really, really relishes making the game easier for his teammates. Here's Ward. Good D by Hardaway. And you can see the defender's afraid to kind of get in his way a lot of times when he's on his way to the basket. But on that one, they were there. On the drive, Morning can be such a force, clearing a path for himself 
through the defense. And here are the Knicks now after the Heat pick up two. Here's a start. Blanketed by the D. He fights to the rim for the layup. Starks has got it all tied up now for the Knicks. Here's Hardaway. He has six. It's tipped. Two on one as they jump out on the break. A huge slam. The perfect end of the fast break. Attacking in transition the most consistent way to generate easy looks. Yep, exactly. And if there's any opportunity for early offense, you've got to push it and push it every time. Here's Hardaway. The Knicks making the shot. Now the pass to Barry. It's rebounded by New York. Well, it's easy to score when you're facing very little resistance. That's why their offense looks so good now. Well, I think it was a combination of things, quite honestly, but the defense didn't really offer them a challenge all night. I agree with that. No defensive pressure at all. I mean, that's not going to get it done against him. There's a minute 34 left to play here in the first. All the way up top. Right now, he averages nearly 23 points a game, a relentless offensive force. Things really clicking for him at the offensive end. They're making good decisions, not wasting these opportunities. Now, here's Mills. Four-point game. Count that one. And he'll take it right into the teeth of the D without thinking twice about it. Miami's gone three of five from three-point land so far in the ballgame. Hardaway for three. Wow, drew the contact, and that three almost went in. So he'll go to the line for three free throws. And now we'll get perspective here on how the hustle game has been going for the Knicks. They're really mucking things up for the opposition, racking up steal after steal, just not letting them develop any kind of offensive rhythm. Another big component of their game early on has been their execution on the fast break. They're getting a bunch of easy baskets, pushing it in transition. Here's Houston. There's the drive, and he dunks it down. That is ferocious. <laughs> you said it. That was ferocious. Ammonia strong, we call that. Wear that rim out. And here are the Heat now. Following the score by New York. It's deflected. Pass to Oakley. Up and in. Off to an efficient start. Two for three from the field. Nice play. And you can see they're gathering momentum. And, you know, they need to stay aggressive here. Build the lead up while they've got the chance. Don't waste this opportunity. Here's Barron. Following the score by New York. Took him no time at all on that one. And how about the stroke there from Barry? He has such an effortless release on his three ball. Just two seconds between shot clock and game. Childs stolen by Marley. Three-pointer. And the Heat, another three. And that's such good work to make this a one-possession game. Terrific steal to get it all started. Oakley a screen on Hardaway to the middle. And Charles Oakley out there with the slam. Well, I tell you what, the big guy knows how to do that. Throw it down. The shot that time, not on target. And that concludes a back-and-forth high-scoring first quarter of play. Next out front, up by three. And Some good action already in this one, but a fairly even matchup after the first quarter of play. And what stands out to you from New York in this one? Well, in that first quarter, they, they were intent on just pounding the ball down low. Yeah, and it's worked. They've got a clear edge and points in the paint. Now we'll see if they go with a more balanced attack or just keep on pounding it inside. Austin, the pass to Grant. A good finish at the rack off the slick feed. That's serving it up on the platter there. What a nice pass. A high percentage look was the result. Passes it to Houston. On the wing, Miami grabs the miss. Following this one, they get to host the Warriors. And that'll be the third of the four straight at home. And the dunk by Austin. Several lead changes going on here in the early portion of this game. It reminds me of that cameo song, Back 
and four. Over to the wing. Right side, Oakley. The rebound by Marley. Marley's got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. Over to the left wing. Here. Kept alive. And the basket by Austin. Now it's a three-point heat lead. You've got to be aware of him at all times. He's a bully on the backboards. We're closing in on two minutes played here in the second quarter. Here's Houston. Six points for him. And he comes up with the deuce. You love the efficiency that Houston scores and plays with. Take smart shots all the time. For Miami, they've gone three of four from the floor here in the second quarter. Grant for three. The rebound by Oakley. Hard to figure out how he doesn't knock that one down. No defender in sight. Mills in the corner. Some nice passing by New York here. Here's Oakley. And Charles Oakley out there with the slam. Just wanting it more. Charles Oakley, he is all about effort. Grant surveying the D. Pass to Austin. It's tipped. Deadly the pass to Houston. Picked off in midair. In transition, here comes Miami. The 19-foot shot, and that one's good by Marley. Marley's got 13. Good quick thinking that time from Marley with the pull-up jumper. New York takes timeout. Both teams will make substitutions. Substitution on the court. New York trailing. The pass to Houston. Lays it up off the glass. Houston's got four points in the quarter. Guys, what a wild first half this has been. <laughs> a while back in fourth start, that's for sure. Here's Barry. And pluck the ball with his pull. What a defensive play. Here's Johnson. Rebound by the Heat. And not allowing the shooter even an inch of breathing room on that one. And guys, that's exactly the kind of high-impact defense they want to see out of him. Basket counts. And we've seen several lead changes tonight. Neither team giving an inch. Yeah, and the lead has changed hands, and it just hasn't stayed in those hands very long when it's changed. Back and forth we go. Childs. And the three ball is good. And the Knicks lead by two. And you look at the draft this year, and the coming years, Clark, a lot more high schoolers are considering making the jump to the pros. Yeah, you know, and that's always been interesting to me. For some, it's the right move, but for most, that's a significant jump that shouldn't be made. But there is another pathway with the NBA founding the Development League in 2001, and that could give some of these high schoolers who may not be ready for the NBA a chance to gain some additional experience. And here's Marley. He's got 13. Pass to Mashburn. Six on the shot clock. John Stokes. Tim Hardaway is checked in for the Heat. First team foul. Into the lineup for Miami. Number 10, Tim Hardaway. Shot from the inbound. Passes to Mashburn. Miami no good on that time either. New York leading by four. Here's Houston. He's got 12. Starts the pass to Oakley. Gets to the rim for two with the D all over him. Oakley's got 10 points. And like that aggressiveness from Oakley inside. He won't be denied. Outstanding at overpowering the defense. Here's Mashburn in the hoop for his third make from the field. He's three for four thus far in the contest. Knicks have gone six of ten from the floor here in the second quarter. Outside Oakley. Here's Johnson. Got a piece of it. Pass to Mashburn. 
Shoots the three. Good on the three-point shot. He's got 10. And you have to be cognizant of Mashburn's long-range shooting ability. This guy is really accurate from out there. Johnson gets to open. And it's in. Basket number six for him thus far. He has only missed two shots from the floor. Oh, man, how about the last-minute decision there to pull the shot down and get a better one for your teammate? Miami trails by three. And Miami calls their first time out of the game. We've seen Larry Johnson really having a great game. He's really taking it to him inside. They got to find a way to slow him down. Substitution for the Knicks. Knicks. Charlie Ward. Here's Barry, covered by Starks. Shots good from Barry. You take a look at the assist numbers for Mashburn, and this is a guy who excels at passing the ball, especially from the forward position. To the paint, here's Ward. That's in there, Johnson with the assist. Ward's got his second bucket of the night. Well, check out that assist. That's a pair of teammates that are clearly on the same page. Here's Hardaway. Nine points in the game so far. Brown outside. Back to Hardaway. And there's the pass to Marley. And again, Miami with the triple. Hey, the moment Marley saw that pass coming his way, Thunder Dan was ready to rock and roll. Mills in the corner. Starks outside. Screen by Oakley. Power down with both hands. The finish was nice, but the setup was better. Yeah, G.A., the pick working to full effect before the stuff. And, you know, not enough help from the defense there to compensate. He gets a clean look, and that's exactly how you draw it up. Tim and you can see him give a little nod and then just burst to the rim for the alley-oop slam. A pair of teammates, Greg, with a terrific feel for each other. And I tell you what, guys, that's a big play to make in a close game. Potential momentum builder there. Takes it inside, and it's Johnson with the jam. This guy is a high flyer, I mean, especially for a power forward, and he needs to be as an undersized player. Snatched away. One-on-one -on -one fast break. Starks outside on the wing, Johnson. Mills passes to Ward. Some nice passing by New York here. Start. Oh, oh wow. What a fierce competitor. They don't want Starks to hold back. They want him in attack mode like on that possession. Miami trails by four. Pass to Brown. Here's Mashburn. That three off the mark. The Knicks shooting a magnificent 69% in this game. Here's Moore. Johnson, the pass to Oakland. Kicks to Starks. Lock at six. New York needs to get off a shot. Hires for three. Here's Johnson. Rebounded by Hardaway. Miami's gotten cold from deep in the second quarter. Just two of six from long range. They get it back. Barry misses. Yeah, he just flat out tricked that one, missed it, and has no one to blame but himself. Pass to Ward from outside the arc. That's good, and he's now three for four from the field. That is his shot, guys. So you can't just give it to him. You've got to get up on him and get into his airspace there. Hardaway from outside. Barry's the long-range jumper. Hardaway has got 12 points in the game. And showing off for the crowd there. Hardaway's handles are off the charts. Starts the pass to Ward. Back to Starts. One oh seven left in the first half of basketball. Well, I cannot believe he didn't capitalize there. And neither can he. Pass to Hardaway. Out to the wing. It's blocked. Oakley kicks to Johnson. There's the pass to Ward. Here's Starks. Oh, my goodness! Come 
Come on now. Oh, and that one, no question, powered it down. John starts putting his vertical to good use. Awesome. And dunking it down. Hardaway with a wide open look. And the Heat, another three. Uh, he's found his rhythm from deep, and, and you can see the confidence. Yeah, I'd be confident, too. As a matter of fact, I mean, if you're stacking up threes the way he is, I mean, he's doing all this work from behind the arc. Wow, and that sort of showmanship is just deflating right now to a team trying to get back into a game like this. Ouch, Greg, that is definitely an emphasis jam, a big apostrophe or exclamation point, maybe even a question mark. And guys, I know there are a lot of questions right now defensively for this team. There's no doubt about that. Misses the limb. He had him with that bump fake. And some nice defense there to end the quarter. So that'll be it for the first half. Fairly even battle underway in this one. Knicks lead by five. We're going to step away briefly, but get you right back out here for the start of the third quarter after our halftime. And in that first half, we saw a pretty tight battle. We'll soon find out what sort of adjustments were discussed during the half. You look at John Starks in this game, he's been everywhere. In that first half, he was a hot knife, and the defense was butter. Sliced right through them. Well, you know what, guys? My question is this. Who's he going to posterize in this half? You know, we've already gotten a number of filthy dunks out of him. Second half of basketball upon us. We may be in for an exciting finish based on how close of a game that's been so far. On the wing, Hardaway. And it's in there. Hardaway has got the first basket of the third quarter for Miami. Yeah, and Hardaway has a nice jumper. Excellent jumper, as a matter of fact, especially from the mid-range. No time wasted getting it off. The nine-foot shot. It's Ewing that time on the assist by Johnson. And the Knicks lead by five. Outstanding execution. Good job working the ball inside. Hardaway passes to Morning. A three from Marley. In it goes for the eighth time in ten tries. Yeah, Thunder Dan Marley, a lights-out perimeter scorer, a talented shooter from deep. Now the feed to Ewing. That shot, no good. Morning with some nice D. The Heat shooting 59% up to this point. They're working for great shots, and they're hitting them. Yeah, but the hand in the face. It's critical that you contest his shots every time down the floor. Or the pass to Johnson. An emphatic alley-oop jam. And how about the incredible timing on that alley-oop? He absolutely hammered it down. Well, I tell you what, that's the play we'll remember if they can put together a little surge to break this game over. Hardaway for three. It's rebounded by New York. Ewing's got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. And he could not get that one to go. Out of contact, and he'll go to the line for two. It goes on Tim Hardaway. And really the defense fouling there to prevent the layup, but that's exactly what you need to do. It is. I mean, no reason to back off and give him the layup. I mean, much better off making him go to the line. That one falls, so he hits both of them. Making it look effortless. Send this guy to the strike. He's going to cash in more than not. Hardaway from outside. Carries it from three-point range. Hardaway has got five points in the quarter. Yeah, Hardaway just great at pulling up off the dribble. You can't allow him any separation when he's got the ball. Ewing the pass to Ward. Back to Ewing. And Patrick Ewing with the slam. And he just dangles from the bucket after sending that one through. And you can see which team has the swagger right now. But you know what? You don't want to do too much to get an opponent riled up. You got to be mindful of that. On deep, Marley. And again, Miami with the triple. It's been this way since halftime. Tremendous production from beyond the arc. Well, it's been a three-point barrage. They came out gunning and have not stopped. Here's Ward. And it's Morning with the rebound. Morning's got his fifth rebound in this one. Here's Marley. And there's another one for the Heat. Look at Morning making the unselfish play, giving it away rather than forcing the shot. 
Well, we're into the third quarter. Just over two and a half minutes played. Ewing. Nice pass. <laughs> Run him to the rack perfectly for the layup. Ewing's got eight points. And, you know, coaches will take possessions like that all day long. Phenomenal use of the screen there. They swipe it. Here's Johnson. And slam dunk by Johnson. And talk about putting some extra on it. That dunk was way over the top. Close game or not, he's going to finish firm when he gets the space. Well, I tell you what, guys. The kids, the young kids like to say, that's doing too much. That falls into that category. That was too much. And it's out of bounds that he's able to retain possession here. Kicks to Hardaway. Trying to go for an alley oop, but excellent defense and anticipation there to stop it. Ewing the pass to Houston. That's good, and Ewing with the assist. Houston's got the lead up to seven now for New York. Boy, you look at Allen Houston work, and it just seems so timeout, easy. Timeout. Comes so naturally to him to score the ball. Timeout called the Heat. the third quarter with just over three and a half minutes off the clock. Morning kicks to Hardaway. Will it go? Sinks it. What range from outside. Wow. Hardaway has got 23. And Hardaway is a volume shooter from deep for a reason. Because he's capable of pulling damage from there. Here's Ward. Started by Hardaway. They get it back. Starts the pass to Houston. Off target from outside. And I thought that was going to drop. It looked good from here. Traps in the tray. Now just a one-point New York lead. Yeah, how about the quick feet there by Hardaway? Terrific at getting to his spot on the floor. Yes, to Johnson. This is it to Houston. Miami grabs the miss. Marley's got six rebounds now in the game. Brown jams it in! As we approach the fourth quarter, still anyone's ballgame. Yeah, neither team able to create much of a cushion. Here's Ward. Nine points in the game so far on the wing, Johnson. Here's Ewing. Out of bounds. Miami takes possession. Here's Miami now. Good momentum. Eight straight points. Right side Hardaway. Here's Mashburn. The Knicks pull it in. The Celtics will be coming into town for the next game. That'll be the first of two straight at home. Kicks it to Johnson. Down low. Here's Houston. Good. It's Johnson with the assist that time. Johnson's got four assists in the game. Coming off a big game, his confidence couldn't be higher. And Coach knows it. Showing no signs of slowing or cooling down. They're going to ride him as far as he can take it. Here in the third, he's really started to heat up from the perimeter. Here's Ward. Johnson in the corner. Here's Houston. He takes it in. The rebound by Marlon. And here's Miami. Stringing it together. They've got an 11-2 run going. And that one's good, Mashburn. And this is how special Mashburn is on the drive, using that athleticism to just explode towards the rim. New York takes timeout. Billy checked in for Brown. And New York with a change here, too. Oakley he's checked in for Johnson. Knicks trail by four. Pass to Houston. Looking for Ewing. He gets it there. Here's Moore. 
Guarded by Hardaway. It's good. Ward's got four this quarter. Now Hardaway. He's got 29 points. He dishes it to Morning. Here's Mashburn. Oh, my. He'll go to the line with a chance for a four-point play. It's going to go on Charles Oakley. And this is his first trip to the line tonight. 76% on the season from the foul line. Guys, when you compare against last year, I mean, this season has been a pretty painful drop-off in his free throw numbers. I mean, he's not making the key chances he's getting at the foul line. Oakley kicks to starts. The pass to Ewing. Unloads from 13. Good on the jump shot. Ewing's got 10. You've got to have a good basketball IQ to be effective. I love the decision to kick it out. The heat on offense. They're on a 17-6 run. Outside Hardaway. Here's Mashburn. They get it again. Morning. Here's the lob to the hoop. Stolen away. Nice job to interrupt the alley-oop attempt there. Here's Houston. He's guarded by Marley. Screen by Oakley. Houston, the pass to Oakley. And Charles Oakley out there with the slam. Terrific accuracy on that pass. That's how you lead your teammate. Here's Barry. Covered by Starks. Outside Hardaway. For three. And it's good. He's made two for every one he's missed. 10 of 15 in the contest. And just no excuse, guys, for leaving a shooter like him open beyond the arc. Pass to Starks. The screen from Ewing. Starks dishes to Ewing. And again, it's New York. And the lack of effort to fight over the screen there makes that an easy shot. Well, I'm going to credit the screen. I mean, that's a good, strong pick he lays there. Outside Hardaway. Passes to Meshburn. Two minutes remaining. Good, and the assist goes to Hardaway. Hardaway has got his eighth assist here tonight. Hardaway is a pure point guard, a pure point guard, effective and not only creating for himself, but really good with his passing skills as well. Back to Starks. And there's the slam dunk to finish it off. Oh, an aggressive move and fantastic finish. Mm, trying to send a message with that slam, I think. That's exactly how you send it. Two hands and down. Timeout called the Heat. Substitution on the court. And here are the Heat now. It's a three-point game. Hardaway for three. Houston pulls it in. New York's gone one of three from downtown since halftime. And out of bounds as the Heat gain possession. One twenty-four left in the third quarter. Now here is Hardaway. He's covered closely. Miami no good on that time either. And he didn't punish them for the weak coverage there, but they can't count on him to continue. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, he got fancy with that one. Yeah, maybe trying to give them the momentum boost they need to break this game open. And I like it. I mean, some coaches might want to see just a sure-handed lay in there, but for me... I don't mind a little extra. Here's Barry. He dents the rim with a two-handed slam. Wow. Oh, that's straight TNT, baby. Uh, Explosive. That was pretty, and he just has that effortless knack for getting inside. I'll tell you what, you hate to be the guy having the responsibility of guarding him. Goes up from the top of the key. Here's Hardaway, and it's blocked. And that's out of bounds. Miami will retain possession. And we got to take a second look to admire that outstanding block. Reads the play well there and gets himself in the air at just the right time. Terrific denial. The Heat making a switch here. Brown's checked in. Brown. 
A floater. Count the basket. Brown's got six. Twenty six seconds left in the third quarter of the game. Pass to Houston. New York moving it around. And the pass to Oakland. Here's Ward. Down to five on the shot clock. Miami grabs the miss. Hardaway has got his fifth rebound in this one. Unloads from 13. And he hits the jump shot. Now it's a seven-point heat lead. Hey, don't let the height of Hardaway fool you. He's not that big, but he can compete anywhere on the court. And so it's Miami bringing the quarter to a close with a seven-point lead. From beyond the arc, they've been absolutely tremendous. And don't go away. We'll be right back. And this is it. Glad to have you along for this fourth and final quarter. Knicks trail by seven. Beyond the arc. And the basket by Starks. Starks has got the first field goal of the fourth quarter here for the Knicks. The Heat shooting around 60% of the night. Amazing work offensively so far. Hardaway with the bounce pass. Austin no luck. And it's Mills with the ball for New York. And it goes out of bounds. Last touch by Hardaway. On defense, Miami. Starks outside. And the Knicks hit again from deep. Well, I love the decisiveness of Starks, making things happen on offense. Here's Hardaway. Takes the three. And again for three. And what a fireworks display he's shown us tonight. Just keeps knocking him down from deep. Craig, he has just exploded from beyond the arc. That last make tying him for second in most threes in a game. And the whistle blows as the basket counts in a three-point play chance right here on free throw coming up. All right, well, a look at how the points have been generated so far. A scoring breakdown for Miami. Well, I think they've been lethal from beyond the arc this game, no doubt about it. Hard to defend such spot-on shooting. Uh, another place they've had the upper hand tonight is in transition. They've gotten a bunch of their points off the fast break. And those are the types of shots down the stretch that win you ball game. Now, here is Stark. <laughs> oh! Oh, he got fancy with that one. Yeah, maybe trying to give them the momentum boost they need to break this game open. And I like it. I mean, some coaches might want to see just a sure-handed lay in there, but for me, I don't mind a little extra. You love how each side has risen to the challenge throughout this one. Hey, defense is taking a back burner. Secondary on the marquee, but who doesn't love a game like this? Let's go. I like offense. Good to see a player going all out in the games this time. You know, G.A., he knows what his job is. Patrol the offensive glass. You know, that time I thought he did it with authority. Tremendous putback at a time when they really need it. Count that one for Mashburn. Jamal Mashburn can certainly take over a game and doing just that here in this one. On the wing, Johnson. We're in the fourth quarter here, just under two and a half minutes gone. Count it. And that's now 25 points for Johnson. And that's right in his wheelhouse, looking to make an impact when it counts. You know, they want the ball in his hands here because they trust him to hit all the big shots. And the Heat call time here. So both teams making some changes here. And now we've got some time to check in from the sideline. They got for us, D.A. Thanks, guys. Brad Nelson had some words for his team during the break. He told them this is what it's all about, proving we're the better team in the tough situation. But you got to want it. Coach told his guys they have what it takes to win here. Guys, back to you. Thank you, David. Johnson the screen. 
It's hauled in by the Heat. Here's Eskins. And he goes in for the dunk. Mashburn getting his hands dirty that time, battling for the offensive rebound and finishing things off after he got it. Johnson outside. Starks outside. Driving to oh! the And talk about putting some extra on it. That dunk was way over the top. Close game or not, he's going to finish firm when he gets the space. Well, I tell you what, guys, the kids, the young kids like to say, that's doing too much. That falls into that category. That was too much. Mills in the corner. Starts outside. Going in. Oh, what a dunk! And guys, that's not as easy as he made it look. You've got to have some skills to pull that off. Well, he's got plenty of those, yes. that's for sure. Yes, indeed. Let's just call him ladder climber. Pass to Austin. Good ball movement here by Miami. And that one's good, Meshburn. Well, he's been doing it all night. Why not go back to it? And no let up in him either, guys. I mean, he wants to continue to expand that lead. And as long as he's the one taking the shot, that lead's going to expand. Here's Johnson. Whoa! Hey, now! Hey, now! <laughs> yeah! A big athletic combo guard. Starks loves to score, but also more than willing to make the extra pass. And too long on the shot. Knicks trail by five. With the drive, uses both hands to slam it down. And despite the size disadvantage, attacking the heart of that defense. You know what, guys? Honestly, I didn't think he'd win that battle. I mean, that's a lot of height to give up. Mashburn. Here's Barry. That's a basket. He is eighth from the field, eight of 14. Second chance points always hurt. Just not enough effort to block out. Hey, guy standing around spectating. I mean, you got to get in there and get tough. Here's Johnson driving the lane. Oh, and the jam by Johnson. A big guy who possesses fantastic mobility. Johnson, tough to stop on the drive. Passes it to Austin. Here's Mashburn, covered by Nick. Mashburn, no good. And they had some boxed coverage that turned into no cover. Brown shot is good. New York calls timeout. York calls timeout. The Knicks making a switch here. Substitution on the court. Knicks trail by five. Johnson in the corner. Pass to Ewing. Here's Houston. No good on the triple. Miami's gotten three of their six three-pointers to fall here in the fourth. It's in and he's a very efficient five for six on the game. Cashing in on the interior, making it look all too easy. New York's gone two or three in the fourth quarter from long range. Good shooting so far. Johnson outside. Foul on the shot. He'll shoot two at the free throw line. Larry Johnson. Grandma Mom is a dependable forward. Excels at scoring in the paint and doesn't mind thumping and bumping. He hits one and misses the second attempt from the free throw line. A heat beaten by six. Oh, drew the foul and almost hit the three-point bucket. Then he'll go to the line to shoot three. First team foul. Is such a skilled player. Mashburn can be a handful to keep up with as a defender. His game has that interesting mix of physicality and agility to it. And the second free throw, good. And he makes all three. Knicks trail by nine. Ewing kicks to Starks. Out to the right wing. Houston drills it from outside. Houston. Houston's got 10 points here in the second half. Gotta love seeing Houston get space there to shoot it from deep. He is one of the best from beyond the arc. Goes up. Throws down the breakaway jam. 
And such a huge play, guys. I mean, that's a four-point swing, possibly. Tremendous steal and conversion right there. Ashburn, the pass to Morning. Good! And the Heat lead by six. Boy, the interior game of Morning, really strong, solid. Excellent at getting quality shots in close. On the wing, Johnson. The pass to Houston. Here's Starks. And the Knicks hit again from deep. Fantastic bomb there, just especially against the taller defender. Clutch shooting, determination, and plenty of skill, too. Here's Hardaway. Pass to Mashburn. Puts up a deep three. A rebound by Larry Johnson. Johnson's got rebound number eight now on the night. Nice move. He lays it in. Larry Johnson. Now just a one-point Miami lead. High drama here, guys. I mean, they've managed to get hot just when it looked like this thing was out of reach. And what a huge injection of energy they got here in crunch time. Suddenly, they're an offensive juggernaut. Now a timeout called by Miami. Well, it's been an express lane to the rim. Coach can't be happy about that. And, you know, I think he's going to tell them simply, we have to show more fight on the interior. That's the top priority right now. And the Knicks making a change here. Ward's checked in. Checking in for the Knicks. Number 21, Charles Ward. New York on D. And that one's good, Mashburn. And that's a huge shot from Mashburn. No stranger to having to Burry, though. Ward, the pass to Ewing. And Ewing slams it in. A timely bucket by Patrick Ewing. His team depends on him to come through in the big moments. And more times than not, he delivers. Passes it to Morning. And another basket for Miami. Important points for Morning. Zoe is a winner, and he wants the ball in that situation. It's to Ewing. And stolen by Morning. Here's Mashburn, and he gets the basket. Officials blowing the whistle, so a chance at the line for one more. Great teamwork punctuated by a strong finish. That is the perfect fast break, guys. Getting a hoop before the defense can get set. And there's the ice cream with the apple pie, folks. Excellent trip up the floor to stretch this lead out. Just in a perfect position to grab that rebound and then get the putback. Raheem leading by four. Hard away with the bounce pass. Here's Morning. A shake and a lot of contact on that one, so he'll shoot two here. You know, Morning has really a very effective shot fake, and once he gets the defense off balance, he cracks right into him to draw the foul. So he goes two for two at the lock, and it's a six-point ball game. Since an opportunity here to increase the lead and capitalizing on it. Here's Ward, and he's good on the three ball. Gets the shot he wants. The defense wasn't quite connected enough. They lost contact. Side Hardaway. Here's Marley. Brown. Money! And those second chance points really become almost like bonus points when you can get them. Here's Ward. Yes! And he has brought them to within two points. Oh, you just love seeing a player with absolutely no fear. Cool, calm, collected, and confident in the good another from three. And of course it falls for him. That three pushes him into the history book. Well, he is now time for the most threes in a game. This is a night we will never forget. You know, I think they took a bit of a chance there going to the double team, and that left another guy open out there. 27 seconds left in the fourth quarter. They'll be trying to take as much time off the clock as they can. Exactly. Expect to see longer possessions from this point on. 
to the inside. More money. Late in the game, game, up big, they continue to attack. I don't think you want to get loose and sloppy or ease up, but it is time for them to start using that clock a bit. Time call here. The Knicks decide to talk it over. They're behind by five. 12 seconds left here in the fourth quarter. Guys, your thoughts? Yeah, trying to get back in this thing. They need a score. Yeah, and they need it hiccup fast. I mean, they'll be drawing up a quick hitter in the huddle here, no doubt. And so it's Miami winning this one. They didn't make it easy on themselves or their fans. But in the end, everyone's satisfied. Well, I mean, there were some times that, that momentum shifted, and, and, and especially early on. But let's give this group a lot of credit for that stick to itiveness in terms of finishing out and executing that game plan. And that about wraps it up. For Greg Anthony, Clark Kellogg, and David Aldridge, this is Kevin Harlan. 